There is a battle for freedom. It's here. It's clear. Some cheer. Some fear. And there's a flag full of questions we are forced to face in this great battle for freedom. History's battle for freedom. If my enemy says he hates me and I can't say to him I love you, am I free? Am I free? If my enemy wants to destroy me and I can't in my heart forgive him, am I free? Am I able to feel at home no matter where? Do my expectations limit my every prayer? If a colleague at work insults me and I can't in my mind overlook it, am I free? I'm not free. If my neighbors are living a lifestyle and I'm deeply, deeply offended, are they free? Does the pressure from peers put me in a fizz? The thoughts of tomorrow wake me till it is. If I'm thinking in terms of how life used to be, longingly, am I free? If reactions jerk my knee, am I free? And make my words much less than me. Now take impatience, yes please do, it's like some bars I'm peeking through. I can't see. Am I free if I can't do a stranger kindness? Cause I'm really, really, really self-conscious. What's with me? Will I ever break through if my intellect won't stop? I try and keep still and my brain keeps talking shop. If I'm stuck in the muck of agree or disagree, can it be? I'm not. There is a battle for freedom. It's here. It's clear. So and we're the spear. We are the weapons. The battlefield, the fog, the spoils, civilians, the generals, the dogs, the royals. We are the battle for freedom, asking the questions of freedom.